it's a standard size piece, then I'd be using the template, right? Because then it just makes it, you don't have to put the, the threaded tenon on there. Instead, you put that on there, put your, uh, your what do you call it, your hinge bit inside of there, you make your three dimples, remove this, and you're all set to go. Okay, now this one is different because it's so thick, but my vise won't fit, and I don't have longer bolts with me, so I'm not going to be able to use those. But that's where these T, the Bessies come in, the holes, the slots for the Bessies, because now you have all kinds of flexibility. Not as easy to do, that's for sure, but I need it to be vertical, so that gravity will hold everything that I need it to hold. I think it's going to work. And again, using the X method, and finding the center. This is on the sinker cypress. So I'm going to use a larger bolt in there eventually, but um, I'm going to need my tenons. So I can put a tenon on there. So the best way to do it is do it the right way, not the wrong way. Got it lined up. as close as it's going to get. Now use the hinge bit. Hinge bit. T bit to pull it off. Craig bit. Craig bit. Craig bit in the center. And again, I can tell it's really a lot softer material. <coughs> so I'm going to go to an even larger bolt. I have some quarter inch with the larger head. I'm going to go ahead and use those. So now I can put my... And again, those have the same T-bit, T25. Tenons are all done on the Cypress version. Ready for mortises.